Seeds. Yeah. Seeds. Yes. I'm losing you to seeds. Not losing me. In Norway. Yes. Yes. Oh, Norway. North. Way north. It's uh, it's the farthest north you can travel on a commercial boat. It sounds convenient. That's part of why they picked it. And it's a seed bank. A vault. More specificity in language, please. I'm sorry. It's something that my mom used to say when she didn't understand what the hell I was talking about. So. <laughs> it's a vault. It's to preserve the world's agricultural seed. It's like a big backup, like Noah's Ark for plants. So you're talking doomsday stuff. Well, it, it's built in turnip crops, so it can stay cold no matter what. It's high up enough that it won't be affected by rising sea water. It's remote enough so that it should be out of any war zones. If anything happens anywhere, well, humans need to grow food to live. So, super far, super cold, super no. This is one fucked up way to break your girlfriend's heart. Now, you'll say girlfriend? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but, okay, okay, but like two weeks ago, you were like, who needs this? I was trying to be cool. Everybody told me, play it cool, because I usually don't. Wait, but you know what else is cool? And not like rad cool? Like, okay. like fucking cold as ice? An underground vault in the goddamn Arctic Circle. Well, I'll give myself up. <laughs> <laughs> of course I do. Can you not tell by how mad I am right now? You are pretty mad. Exactly. And I did want to be your girlfriend. That is all I wanted. No, I don't. Because of seeds. You're choosing seeds over me. That's not fair. I know. I, I should breathe and smile and say, Congratulations, baby, I'm getting your dream job. But this is this is all fun. This is like side fishing. It's just a year. A year? I have eight shows a week. I know. I can't leave. I worked too hard to get this show. I know, but I want you to know. <laughs> I'm not coming. Dude, I hate this. How have I given up enough? I, I, I do all the things. I, I, I carry a metal straw in my purse. I buy carbon offsets. I worry. I protest. I vote. And here, I have to give you up. Because we are so sure that we fucked up the planet that we need something as insane as a giant freezer to make sure we don't all starve to death. You don't have to do this. I do. There's space time. Uh, long distance is the worst, and I swore that I would never do this. Why have I not taken your Instagram off? Like, you know, why do you have to be so smart and amazing? Don't you? I'm not amazing. I'm boring. I'm willing to supervise a vault in the side of a glacier. I mean, why do you <laughs> even like me? You're like Greta, saving the world. And no, of course I, I like thank you. Why? First of all, you're magic. My job is like the best data. You, they say go into the room and pretend to be another person and make me believe that person and their story, and you do. Sure, we need seeds, but we also need stories. That's pretty hot when you're mad. So, <laughs> so, yeah, I like you. I really like you too. I actually thought about not dating you, but I did. I mean, finally met someone awesome, and I don't want to lose you, but I. No, 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 no. I, I, I get it. You should go. I, I can't. I can't stand. That one day some lone survivor is going to trek to Norway for seeds to save the human race. There's no way to know, but uh, for some reason the idea of the Vulcan being part of it is. Well, I think that is the most alarming amount of camp. <laughs> I am always looking back. I love 
Yeah. 